against an AFC class to kick off Week 10. Baltimore looks to make it four in a row for Miami, who they've outscored a whopping 137 to 16 in the last three meetings. It's the Ravens and Dolphins on Thursday night. They'll look to throw now on first down. Buying time to his left. And get this to his tight end, Gesicki. And take this to the other side of midfield before going out of bounds. So in Raven territory now, here's a first and 10 at the 49-yard line. He'll look to throw. Steps away to his left. And he'll go out of bounds right around the 40. They'll wind up getting nine after tucking it and running, so it'll leave him with second and a yard. He'll look to throw. He's going to find his tight end. That's Hunter Long. And finally, down he goes as they work it inside the 10 to the 7. Now a chance to make that big play really hurt. It's first and goal just outside the 5. The quick slant caught. That's good for a gain of six, second and goal. They're going to look to throw. He's got it. Touchdown, Dolphins. Terry Kelly is a level. They'll look to throw here. And going deep for Hill. That's caught inside the 20. And they're going to have this in a great spot way down in Baltimore territory. From the red zone now, they'll look to throw. And he's got his tight end, Gesicki, in the end zone. Touchdown, Dolphins. Mike Gesicki with a lucky number 13 touchdowns now on the year. And the Dolphins have taken the lead. They'll try and start this drive in the air. Forced out to his left. And going deep for Hill. He's got a man complete. And he finally goes down, but not before reaching the 21. Back to throw here. Being chased out left. And he's got his tight end, Gesicki, in the end zone. Touchdown, Dolphins. Mike Gesicki with his second touchdown. From the midfield stripe, they'll look to throw. And going deep for Hill. And incomplete on the deep ball. And I think they'd be well served to take that type of a physical approach against him the rest of the game. He's had his way so far. But on that last one, that worked quite well for the defense. Now this throw caught left side. And he goes down, but not before getting this inside the 25. On first down, he'll drop to throw. Dancing to his left. They'll get five out of the moment. It's and we have to get the flag on that one. They thought that they had him. Instead, he was coated in Teflon and got away. And that is caught. Touchdown, Miami. Tyreek Hill with his second touchdown here in this first half. And the Dolphins are able to grow their lead. Showed some of his improv skills there, getting flushed out of the pocket, but still able to make the throw. From deep in their own territory, they look to throw. Room past the 20, and he'll take this across the 25 before going out of bounds. 
partner, it's often the man coverage is easier for a quarterback to run against. You get your receivers going downfield. Those guys are staying with them, and oftentimes they have their back to the quarterback, which opens up a lot of space and room, and they don't even know that he's taken off with it. What a big-time pickup on that play. They'll set up a throw. Buying time to his left. They'll get eight on the scramble there. It'll be second and a couple. And they're going to hurry back to the line now. Second and two. Steps away to his left. And he takes a shot on the release as this will be incomplete. Something we haven't really seen much of from him, an incomplete pass. Yeah, last week he finished at 70%. This week he's up over 80%. I don't know how you slow him down. Pass rush is usually the best way because a quarterback on his back usually can't complete a pass. And this pass broken up. They'll come out throwing here to start the drive. That's complete to his tight end, Mike Kosicki. And he is out of bounds, but first he gets it inside the 10 to the 7. A big play there for the Dolphins. Now a chance to make that big play really hurt. It's first and goal just outside the 5. Flushed out right. This is caught. Touchdown, Dolphins. Hunter Wolf. to throw here on first down. Forced out to his left. Toward the sideline, and look at that catch. Dragging the toes, and that's going to be a first down. Well done. A big play there for the Dolphins. So how about that for a chain mover? They're all the way down inside the 40 now for first and 10. Look to throw, and chased out left. And he gets it down a yard or two shy of the 30 before he's out of bounds. They'll get eight on the scramble there. It'll be second and a couple. They'll drop the throw. Dancing to his left. Airs it out toward the corner of the end zone. And oh, it'll be intercepted. Picked up by Marcus Williams. And the Ravens. They go back to the air here after the INT on the last drive. And he'll just get rid of it. They don't get the hook up there, but you really have to marvel at how precise he's been throwing the football these last couple weeks. Oh, that's a perfect word for it, precise. Because if you're at 70% or better two weeks in a row, you have a job as long as you want one in this league, won't you? I mean, West Coast is not just West Coast offense either. He's putting the ball down the field as well. So the big play gets him across midfield now for first and ten. Escaping the pressure right. And that one drops down incomplete. Good coverage there. Forced the ball free and it's second down. They'll stick with the passing game as he looks to throw. A hit as he throws there incomplete. Oh, that's got to frustrate him a little bit because they nearly got to him there, and it would have been the first sack of the game. Instead, they're able to influence the release, and they did force the incomplete pass. Buying time to his left. He's got the first down here inside the 30. And he is out of bounds, but not before he's inside the 30. Normally, we're talking about a quarterback duel where they're matching each other pass for pass. How about the footwork in this one? Both of these guys running the ball well. Yeah, they've mixed in the run game. You're exactly right. Now, both coaches might not like how much their quarterbacks <laughs> have taken off, but another example right there of just good mobility. So a decent gain, but all for naught on the penalty. It's too bad, isn't it? They were feeling pretty good about it. The only people celebrating, the guys who just gave up that play. Flush to his right. On the run, he'll let this go deep right side. Touchdown! Raheem Mostert. Touchdown number 15 on the year. And the Dolphins have got it on cruise control. Solid response that time by a young quarterback. Last drive interception, this drive the touchdown pass. I like 
like how you described it solid. Throw now on first down. Steps away to his left. He'll have a first down past the 40. And finally down at the 41 yard line. One play has him up past the 40 already. And another first and 10. And he is going to be taken down. And that should be the final play of this third quarter. The defense rising to the challenge and setting him back on the sack. One quarter remains here in this Thursday night matchup. You are watching the NFL on EA Sports. Space to maneuver at the 40. And he goes out of bounds just shy of the 45. A breakdown defensively there as the scramble is going to set him up with a much more manageable third down. Now back to throw. And going deep for Hill. And he fires one that's intercepted. Picked off by the Pro Bowler, Marcus Peters. And the Ravens are going to take over at their own 41. Trying to shake off the interception from the last drive. He'll look to throw. And throw complete to his tight end row. And he lost the football. And it's picked up by the Ravens. And they will be sad now as he brings this thing all the way back inside the 20. They'll come out throwing here on first down. Eluding the pressure right. Now he's going to throw deep right. It's caught inside the 20. And all the way in for a Miami touchdown. Right. Now on first down, he'll drop to throw it. And this will be well too low for him to bring in. It's incomplete. They're certainly not letting up on the pressure in this one. And oftentimes you hear this expression, all gas, no break from defenses. But in this case, is the offense still throwing the football up big in the fourth quarter. And he'll go out of bounds after taking it a little further down inside the 40. Now a stoppage here as it looks like we've got a Dolphin shaken up on the play. The Dolphins on third down, just one for three thus far. Here it's third and two, flushed out right. We'll get an update when we come back to Hard Rock Stadium. Well, the other day they told us when we've got third and five or less, we have to be able to convert. And I guess every team would say that, Charles, but an opportunity missed there. What they were trying to tell us is they believe it's a matchup game at that point. And they liked some matchups that they had, thought they could exploit them, unable to do so on that play. And they're able to get this one past the 30 down to the 25. Let's go, boys. Two minutes left to play in this football game here on EA Sports. So the Dolphins have it as we welcome you back in. And no doubt what they're looking to do is just salt away the final couple of minutes and escape with a win. And he's going to take this one down to about the 23-yard line. Credit him with a one-yard gain there to make it second and nine. Again, they'll run it with Mostert. A strong, broken tackle on that one. And then they get him to the ground, just shy of the 15. On third and short, they'll try and pick it up through the air. Forced out to his left. And he'll be out of bounds, taking it just shy of the 10 at the 11 or the 12. Now this is a feeling I can relate to all too well. Deflation on third and short. Excellent coverage. Took away all the short routes, but the one person who wasn't accounted for, the quarterback. And he used his legs to hot foot it for a first down. And running room hard to come by here. He gets it down to the eight. Give him a couple on the carry there. Second and eight. On second down, Mostert. 
And he'll be taken down here, and that is how this one is going to come to an end. But Charles, it's one thing to win. It's another thing to win and put up the amount of points that they did.